Welcome back to Let's Play Bionic Commando. I'm Burning Dog Base. And we're out here at the park. Shit! Deactivating more mines. Mechanic status report number 41. Uh, filed by Private Theodore N. Yanero. Uh, received 15.02 p.m. Wait. Wait! There's no a.m. or p.m. in 24-hour time. That's the point of 24-hour time. I mean, that would be, uh, 3.02 in the afternoon, yes, 15.02, .02, but, uh, PM is irrelevant. I just find it odd that they would make that kind of mistake in a video game like this. Oh well. Having just examined the STB-5 Mohorovic, I noticed slight wearing on the head plating or traction mechanism. The plates still open and close properly, but suffice it to say, further stress on the mechanism, or any obstruction in the plates close, will likely result in unwanted exposure to the STB-5's eye. As reported earlier, the central optics in the Mohorovic's head must be protected for the unit to function properly. I'm going to get into a boss fight. Subject the enemy part two. Buford to Chaffel, the enemy part two. Captain, I've managed to find some more information about Nathan Spencer. I'm not sure, but I believe this is from some kind of medical record. Lee, the only part of the brachium is intact. Uh, um, <clears throat> Lee, the upper part of the brachium is intact. Of the left upper arm skeletal structure, only the upper extremity of the humerus has any integrity at all, and even this may ultimately require amputation. Although subject number 971, Spencer Nathan, could consider himself fortunate that the grenade blast didn't do any extensive damage to his head or torso, I firmly believe the uh, trauma is sto so extensive that any attempt to restore the subject's left arm would be futile. In accordance with the directions given from, received from Task Research Division, I am forwarding subject number 971's medical file and my own notes for review. I do hope that they can help this brave young... G7. You know what's true? He is pretty lucky that he survived this intact after a grenade going off. But, uh... You know, lucky is a relative term. What? So dumb. Oh fuck, I forgot about that. Sneeze. You know, a friend of mine pointed out that, uh... This whole thing with a bionic purge... It's sort of like Deus Ex in reverse. 
another thing came to mind earlier when I mentioned the uh, the weird mod of the Dota reference, but uh, stuff was happening and it kind of slipped my mind. God damn it. Run him out. Oh no! There was, uh. But yeah. Uh. Deus Ex Human Revolution is a prequel where uh, people with cybernetic uh, enhancements I believe they call them augmentations in uh, that universe were uh, straight up uh, prejudiced against You know, uh, in, in a very real way that was, uh, uh fairly analogous to, be, to, uh, racism. Like, I think the most ridiculous example being a, uh, a theater you find at one point, where that literally has a sign in the front window next to the, uh, ticket hall, augmented people enter from the back. You know, it's a very major theme of the game that, uh... You know, as I understand it, that, uh... Sorry, they just got distracted by a uh, text message. Yeah, as I understand it, it's a very major theme of the game that, uh... People don't trust, uh... The augmented. They want to, uh... You know, they'd rather that nobody had uh, augmentations. But uh, eventually, humanity as a whole kind of warms up to the idea, which gets you to you know the original Deus Ex, where almost everybody has some level of augmentation. And uh, look at that. Oh, no, that is where I'm supposed to be going. It's just a burning tree. Yeah, so almost everybody has some level of augmentation, and they're all totally cool. Uh, looks like it kind of went in reverse here. They invented bionics, you know, Task got their bionic army. Joe, I'm outside the Archive building. Magnificent, isn't it? The largest collection of information in the world. It's the undertaking of projects like this that make the FSA such a great country. I suppose it's seen better days. So have I. It's still in one piece, which is saying something. It should be. The building is one of the most heavily fortified in the country. In the perfect place to hide that device. Here, you know, they invented bionics. They, you know, Task created their army of bionic commandos. And, uh, you know, the public was great. You know, the, these guys saved the country. It's, uh... Outstanding. And uh, we're all very grateful. And then it just seems like paranoia took over. And, uh. Eventually, the. Oh, damn it, I was trying to get a screenshot, but.
<laughs> oh, there we go. Ah, damn it! Got a screenshot of the loading screen. Amazing. Well, I can pull one from the footage. Your paranoia took over and people in the archives. Stop trusting uh, Bionics. Secretary, we're out of time. You have to give Spencer access to the carrion device and have it extracted from the city. The man's a Bionic! He can't be trusted with that kind of power! Enemy units are approaching. Secretary, authorize access now! This'll be on your head, Joe. Fine. I'm sending the code to access the main vault. What? No. Why did I... Why did this time I think it was going to be the other trigger? No! Dick butt. Access to carrion device denied. <sighs> that sucked. Oh. We've got company. Take out every one of those terrorist bastards if you have to. I'm not gonna lie to you, buddy. That was the plan. You have no idea what you are up against, my old friend. Surrender now. Holy! That is many dudes. Or I'd already have that gun out. Enough of you! No! The books! What have I done? What fresh hell is this? You piece of shit! Damn straight! I threw him so hard his model glitched out. I'm over here! Yes, grenade launcher. What in the? Oh 
shit. Mmm, delicious. I think he's mad. Thanks for your contribution. I'm sure everyone will remember you. As the idiot who died in the first salvo. No, you won't. In fact, you almost killed your own friend. I don't know if you've been paying attention, buddy, but... It ain't just one. didn't uh, locate the carry-in device.
hidden sensors determined that I was bad as a bad enough dude to deserve the carrion device. It's here. I've sent you coordinates to the extraction point. Hurry, Spencer. We're almost done here. So Sounds gonna... reasonable. Just point me in the right direction. I'm gonna grab this thing. This will probably come in a little bit more handy than the uh, machine gun against a giant robot. better. Was that the timer? I suppose it was. Well then in that case, I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Bionic Commando. When we keep moving. Later!